UB.net presents Poker Tonight. Coming up, Poker Tonight bids a fond farewell to its inaugural season by taking a look back at all of our favorite moments. From Mike the Mouth Mattisos meltdowns to Phil's best blowups, it's been an exciting run. We'll revisit Mike Sexton's induction to the Poker Hall of Fame, as well as our best in studio interviews. Who is Durr? Turned out to be a tougher question than we thought, and who can forget Lane Flack's arm wrestling domination? And on top of it all, we've stacked the deck with more outtakes than we'd even like to admit exist. All that, plus the best moments from Dana Workman in the Weekly Miss Deal, on Poker Tonight. Hello and welcome to Poker Tonight, the best of edition. I'm Scott Huff, and alongside me is Joe Seabach and Seabs. I don't know if you noticed, but I've brought out my best of suit and tie combination right here for the best of episode. I believe this was week nine. Stunning. <laughs> I'm going to be honest, it's absolutely stunning. And how do you feel tonight? <laughs> I feel ecstatic. We got through the first season, and in truth, I think we actually accomplished a lot. We went to the World Series main event, the Bahamas, Bellagio, even some poker players' homes. And UB.net gave away a whole bunch of seats to the 2010 WSOP main event. That being said, wow, quite a ride, my friend. It has been. I mean, be honest, though. When we first started the show, did you think you would make it all the way to the final episode of the season? Maybe not after the first show. The first one maybe uh, was a little bit rough, but after that, I, f I feel like we got our chops. I think we did all right. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know, buddy. You tell me. Take a look. Hello, everyone, and welcome to Poker Tonight. I'm Scott Huff, and alongside me is my friend and professional poker player, Joe Seba. Oh, sorry. Uh, sorry. <laughs> Sign up for the free roll on September. September? <laughs> oh, my. Can what? Where did that come from? I don't even know where that came from. <laughs> this show will be back in September. <laughs> That's right. In order to help some poker, sorry. <laughs> ah, yeah, baby. That's right. That's right. Last week, we came to play the pokers with the men. See, that's how you pull off. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> that's. I can't think of any place else. Any little. I don't know. Sorry. Thank you, Scott. I, I think. <laughs> you know, truthfully, I can't imagine any place that I would rather be than sitting at this desk with you right now, my man. Ouch. <laughs> All right, Huff. Not bad. Not bad. But if I remember, there were more than a few screw-ups on your end as well. Welcome back to Poker Tonight. Be sure to stick around later for Dana Workman and Louis... Uh, and Louis... 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 Congratulations to Mackay Pfeiffer, though. I still see no resemblance... Ha! 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 Love you, magician. Now let's... <laughs> <laughs> All right. And meanwhile, the New England Patriots got absolutely nothing except for, uh, you know, their heads punched. <laughs> My first one was a little better than that. <laughs> Their heads punched in. It's kind of like those character actors. <laughs> so let's talk first a little bit about the play within the hand itself. Anybody got any idea? <laughs> All big recognizable names on this list. Phil Ivey and Daniel Negrano in the top two spot. I think we should redo that one, John. I don't think it's gonna play. You don't think that's gonna work? All right, buddy, truce. I really don't <laughs> wanna see any more of that. Look, I, maybe I shouldn't be admitting this to you, but in all honesty, there was something that I thought you did very well in the first episode, actually. I think you totally nailed it. We called it taking it down to Fifth Street. All right, my man, here's a question. Who or what is a dur? I have no idea. Dur, I don't know. Dur? I have no idea. Uh, you got me during right now. I don't know, man. Well, if you had to take a guess, what would you, what would you say? Mm. Derwiner Schnitzel? <laughs> Probably some weird name for a drug of some sort. I'm gonna say it's, uh, it's a German word for donkey. <laughs> this tie is amazing, by the way. I want to let you know that. Uh, I think the best thing that I could come up with is... Money. Who or what is Durr? Who or what is Durr? Who or what is Durr? Uh, Durr Wiener Schnitzel? <laughs> That's actually the second time we've gotten that answer today. Really? Is it a person on the pro circuit for poker? Uh, it might be. Is he uh, a poker player? Getting getting hot, getting hot. Durr. Doesn't ring the bell, Durr. 
Like, duh. Or maybe played in my mother's basement or something like that. Well, he may be soon if he keeps playing the way he's been playing recently. <laughs> I have no clue. Who or what is Durr, my man? Uh, Tom Dwan. That's Tom Dwan. Lock it up. That's pretty easy. Durr. Seebs, nice job on that, <laughs> my man. Oh, thank you. I think. <laughs> <laughs> now, just because we've had a lot of fun on the show doesn't mean we haven't covered anything serious. One of the biggest stories last year was WPT host, professional poker player, and ambassador of the game, Mike Sexton, being inducted into the Poker Hall of Fame. We were proud to have Mike as a guest on the show, as well as to be invited to his induction dinner. Many of poker's biggest and brightest were in attendance at the Rio Hotel and Casino in Las Vegas to witness the induction of Mike Sexton as the 38th member of the Poker Hall of Fame. I mean, he is really is deserving of this honor, you know. I mean, he's one of the, the most deserving people that I believe that's ever been inducted. I've had a great time with Mike for eight years. We played a lot of poker together. You know, he had his tough nights and his bad nights, but I've never once ever tell me a bad beat story, even when he's lost everything. That's the kind of guy he is. But on top of that, truly talented, fun to be with, fun to work with. This is the first time we've had a proper Hall of Fame uh, induction banquet, and Mike Sexton was the hands-down uh, favorite to, uh, to enter the Hall of Fame this year. He is an absolute class act. He's a great ambassador for the game, and we're honored to have put him into the Hall of Fame this year. Cash these chips in. No. Mike Sexton, consummate professional player, true ambassador to the game. It really was a joy to see him get into the Hall of Fame. And he taught me everything I know about hosting <laughs> poker shows on television. Well, let's check in with Dana Workman and see what's coming up tonight on the Weekly Miss Deal. Thanks, guys. Coming up tonight, all my favorite jokes from the past season. Oh, don't worry. I'm sure we can dig up a couple of outtakes of you as well. <laughs> yeah, if any even exist. When we get back on Poker Tonight, we'll have the best of the past season's in-studio interviews right after this.